Welcome back in the post game. Jeff Lampin, Corey Ospin here tonight on kick 106.7. And Corey, congratulations. A 3 0 victory here tonight. Uh, everything you girls expected? Yeah, um, we just wanted to go out and play how we play. Very relaxed, uh, it looked like, early on in that first game. How did you guys keep any of the emotion or nerves uh, kind of so buried here tonight and come out just very relaxed? Um, we just, you know, played our game and played how we wanted to play. What was the game plan uh, against Woodward Granger? What did you know about him? What did you learn about him over the last few days? Um, we knew they had one good outside of the and she was our main person. Looks like you guys served at her a lot tonight. Was that trying to keep her from being able to get as many looks out of the either front or back row? Sometimes, yeah, but other times it was just the way it was Talk about the, the play at the net. Uh, you guys kind of get off to a pretty good start in that first game. Did you feel like you were in a good rhythm right away? Yeah, I thought we, we were pretty good. Yeah. How did you feel like you hit the ball tonight? Um, pretty good. Uh, I probably didn't have as many cuts as we had, but, you know, it's a team effort. What was the difference for your team tonight? Um, I feel like we passed the ball really well, and then we put the ball away right away, so. How about blocking tonight? Uh, did you feel like you guys were able to kind of defend and block well? Yeah, blocking has been gotten a lot of and we did pretty good. They had two big middles. I know you don't swing a lot out of the middle, but uh, what were you thinking uh, as far as having to deal with those two? Turn and miss the block. <laughs> Corey, uh, you heading over to Webster City now. Does it matter to you guys, Grundy Center or West Marshall? Nope, we'll just, we just play win. All right, Corey, appreciate you joining us here. Thank you very much. Thanks, Congratulations. Jeff. Thank you. Corey Osman.